Hi friends, in this video we are going to see how to create the parameters by using the formula options. Before uh, you are entering to formulas, just make sure your parameter checkbox is enabled in your settings. For this one just go to tools, options, part infrastructure and check these parameters. Then only this parameter icon will visible on your tree structure. Just give OK. So the purpose of parameters to avoid the errors. If I give default thickness value for this part. So everywhere I am going to create a thickness of this part. I will link this parameter with the thickness of my part. So if in uh, if later stage if I want to change the parameter of thickness. I can edit it here itself so that my overall part thickness will change. So this parameter uh, I will create. I am going to create the new parameter. So just I am going to create the thickness. For thickness we need to give length parameter. I am going to create new. So just rename it to Thickness value and just giving 3 mm and give apply. Okay, then give OK. And uh, one more thing, I am going to create one center hole of this uh, plate. Uh, in some variant, uh, it, the center hole is required. For some of the variant, it is not required. So, those things also I am going to control here by giving the Boolean. Parameter for this one, just going to I am just going to create one more new parameter with the boolean parameter. So here I am going to mention center hole. So it is not taking; it is showing the length itself. So once again, I am just. Just I delete this one because of this it is not taking. So this boolean I am going to rename it. Apply. So this part thickness already I have given. So this one I have deleted. scroll down you can find the so once you double click it this parameter will highlight it here now your thickness is linked with this parameter if you see it is kind of showing logged you can't edit it here just give ok so this parameter is defined Next, I am going to create one wall on the side. So this one already I have created. So for this one, this this formula we need to define it as thickness of the part. So this one also I am just going to select this thickness value. Just double click it here, it will get activated. Then give OK. So, this one also you can able to see the formula symbol so that this value is linked to this thickness value. So, so this one say that just I'm doing one pad. So, now I'm going to create one center hole. So this hole is created. How I am going to control this hole? 
by the help of parameters I will tell you just click here and go to formulas here you can see the packet activity so the third packet 3 is active so this one I am going to add formula just give add formula and then select here the boolean center hole which we already created so now this packet activity is linked to this center hole give ok and apply give ok so if you see the condition of this center hole is true so true means it is activated if i give false it is deactivated if we have we have too many holes with related to the central hole. If central hole is present, these two side holes need to be added. If central hole is not there, if you need to remove this hole, those kind of conditions you can provide by using this boolean operation. Hope this video is helpful. Please subscribe to this channel, like and share, add your comments. If you have any doubts, please add your comments. Thanks for watching this video.